against a shaman. Hmm. Keep these. Careful, I may end up qualifying from the tournament. Well, I kind of want to get to top ish legend. For one, I, I think that, like, you know, having familiarity with the various decks in wild is, is valuable if I do end up casting the tournament. So I only see Reddit posts with my name on them. So I mostly pay attention to, for being perfectly honest. <laughs> We're gonna start with Cleric. For probably like a Trog, we can potentially farm it for a card. I did, I did know the Power Shield, so actually maybe it was... I was gonna Totem Golem? Ancestral Knowledge. Coin Ancestral. Alright, well I will not be giving you a beatdown, I suppose. He's probably gonna, like, actually... This is probably a, uh... A Malagos deck. If he's Coin Ancestral knowledge in here. I have nothing good against the Malagos deck that I can actually get with Shadow Visions now, especially now that my Powered Shield is gone. Maybe I want like a Pain if he has... Maybe I want an Entomb. Maybe he's... Eh, Entomb's probably the best of these if he's, uh... If he's like the Nazoth version, though. There's Tortola. So we need to be, like, as aggressive as we can be, which is not very aggressive. What's Omnistone? It is a Hearthstone talk show featuring myself, Frodan, and Firebat. I'm gonna Kazakus for five here. We want to, like, make a guy. I haven't had anything die. We'll take draw two. Nothing's died, so I can't resummon anything. I mean, maybe I just take resummon two just in case he kills things. I could take... I could take add two random demons, then I'll even burn a card. And eh, let's just take this with the assumption he's gonna kill stuff. Like if he like volcanoes me or something. I mean I assume his hand is like various burn. Yeah, there's the volcano. Oh yes. Oh yes. Do it. Do it. Ancestral spirit it. Ancestral spirit. Curses. He, he cast a Farsight, so he could have Ancestral Spirited it for zero mana. It's possible he is not the Ancestor's Call version, that he is the, uh... Okay, there's an Earth Elemental. Any Ancestral Spirit that. Huh, well, I have two Entombs now. I'll use the real Entomb. I guess we heal first. We use the real Entomb so he doesn't know we got an extra Entomb. I'm at 131. Right here, I moved it so you can see it. Devolved. He devolved a board that has none of my uh, death rattles, which is actually fairly great. This is slightly annoying because I actually can't uh, can't get rid of this trickster, <laughs> and this is just gonna kind of sit here rotting. I think my opponent devolved because he didn't necessarily have a way to deal with like my my like big health guys, but it is odd. Devolved seemed kind of unnecessary. The storm also rolled low on like this and this. Not that it, you know this guy actually want to be dead. So my Nazoth doesn't actually do much. My Nazoth currently brings back these two, and that's what. And is that it? Haha! Tied with his Earth Elemental. Hilariously. Oh, Sludge Belcher, right. The Sludge Belcher I stole. No, I, did, it, I, I don't get it back from, from the Denizov, because it didn't, it didn't, uh, no, it did die on control, never mind. But yeah, I would bring that back, but there's, there's one other thing. What else did I play? I played a Tortola. No, but that got devolved. 
Tortola did get devolved. Why don't you heal this guy so he survives a uh, elemental destruction? Oh, the turtle got volcanoed. Yeah, no, it does come back. Right, it was it was the Kazakas, the Kazakas and the uh, Cabal Talon Priest that got devolved. So Tortola will come back. So right now it's two Boombots, Tortola, Sludge Belcher that come back off this. Oh! Maybe Tunneler! <laughs> He's getting me closer. <laughs> it's actually still just a super scary board. Not a Sludge Belcher now. The second Sludge Belcher just got devolved, so. But this board still just kills you very easily. So you better have something. I have 18 power on this board, so yeah, Volcano is very likely to leave like this or this alive. Looks like Thing From Below is going to live. Eh. I kind of hope I get a Weasel Tunneler back. Yes, I did! He's already devolved me twice. Volcanoed me twice. Have another Weasel, buddy. I hope he just draws Weasel. We actually saw that at HCT. Someone drew a Weasel, like a turn where they needed to draw something that came off of like a Maelstrom Portal that died or whatever. It was great. I have no time for games. Uh, okay. Are you like reincarnating that? Ancestral Spirit and Reincarnate? Take the Weasel. Here you go, have a Weasel. Took a Sludge Belcher, that's kind of rude. Alright. That is rude. Um, I have 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. If I were to just entomb this and go face. Do I entomb one of these? I guess I have to entomb a Sylvanas. Attack here and then attack with the Weasel. It is true that I could potentially kill him with Boombots. 11, 12, 13, 15. Mm. I didn't heal this. But he's gonna attack it anyway. Oh, he took my other taunt. Stop! Okay. Well, this is actually starting to kind of be be some nonsense. There's his Nzoth, though. So, um, I attack this into here, these two into... Uh, we have to... We can't, can't quite kill this, right? If you attack this into here, these two into this, and Light Bomb. I guess first things first, we attack this into here. Let's see what we get off of this. Ooh. You can have uh, Kel'Thuzad. It's like the one scary thing. Annoying, but it's not that scary. I have two Sylvanas in my deck. I hope you draw a weasel. He has two weasels in his deck, so. We still have a dragon fire and an excavate and a death in our deck. Okay, white eyes. It's kind of annoying. Sylvanas. It's kind of scary putting the 10 10 into his deck and then playing a Death Lord, but he's 13 14 plus this. I don't think he really has any burn though. This deck doesn't play any burn, does it? Mm, I still actually kind of want to get damage on this so I can trade this thing in. No, but I don't want him to death, be able to Death Lord out. I don't want to be able to Death Lord out a 10 10 or. 
have more things on board to make the Sylvanas worse. Yeah, the one, the one really scary thing remains Kel'Thuzad. We hope he's just drawing weasels every turn. We have Amara to heal, so it doesn't matter that... Well, now actually our Reno's active because we drew a Sylvanas. Because I can like randomly have like a Jade Lightning in his deck at this point to burn me out. Why not kill the 1-1? One, one? I killed the White the, the white Eyes this turn. Do we have another Hex? Both Hexes already? I mean, I guess it's not already. He's, only, he's like quite a bit through his deck. Okay. There's Excavate. Um, I can attack this into here, attack this into here, heal this, Excavate, so then he has a 7-8 left. These are, these are dead. And then play Amara. So his Nazoth is gone. <laughs> the weasel thought alert! There it is! <laughs> oh, that was like that was the perfect ending to that game.